so that was some new content there. As some of you may know, Sarthor was one of the earliest Nord settlements in Skyrim. It was also the largest. Sacked by the elves in the infamous Night of Tears, not much is known about what happened to Sarthor. Uh. Okay. Alright, sorry about that. Some stuff going on. But we're back. This is an exciting opportunity for us to be able to study such an early civilization. This is better than sitting around talking about magic. Well, are there any questions before we begin? We're particularly interested in the prevalence of magical seals placed on the tombs here. It's rather unlike anything we've encountered. Okay. I mean, now do you know kind of what we're looking for? Anything. Anything. And if along the way my message about the dangers of magic should happen to sink in. Yeah, yeah, we heard it. Ah, yes. Well, why don't you see if you can assist Arniel Gain? He's one of our scholars, here working on cataloging our finds. I expect he'd appreciate some help in locating any additional magical artifacts here in the ruins. Any enchanted items will do. The usefulness of the enchantment is irrelevant. If you find anything, the class can look it over. Now, okay. let's see. What shall we have the rest of you do? Brelina, my dear, why don't you search for warding magics? Anything designed to keep people out. Don't interact with them. Just identify them. On them, please search that area over there. See if you notice any residual energies. Alive or undead. Cesargo, what shall we have you do? Ah, why don't you verify that we're the first ones here? Look for any amount of tampering with the tombs. All right, everyone. Let's be careful, but have fun. Do <laughs> you think there's treasure here? Something to make Jezargo a powerful wizard. Jezargo finds nothing but dust in these ruins. Why do you think we're here? Because Torfdir says so. He says there are things to learn here. Alright. You excited to be here? Oh yes. Jezargo hopes to... Yep. Hopefully small things that fit inside pockets. Alright, we heard this one. Noticed if they are missing. Until next time. Trailer, what do you find? To think, my ancestors destroyed the homes of Onwin's ancestors. So much bloodshed. Are you a little nervous about your being here, then? Why? Because it's old and full of dead things? Clearly, you've never spent any time in Morrowind. Uh, do you have anything else Not for? really. Just that it's very, very old. It was one of the first cities of men in Tamriel, I think. All right. All right, then. Um, and where to go, buddy? Please be careful here. The site isn't entirely secure. Can you imagine what it was like living here so long ago? The first men in Tamriel. Here. I mean, you don't seem very happy about this. No. There's no <laughs> chance anyone in authority approve this. <laughs> Our ancestors should be allowed to rest in peace. Uh, no. No, I'm not. Hopefully, we can learn something from the experience. How the ancient Nords used magic. Maybe even what happened to this place. Alright. Mm -hmm. Well, see, there's some value in this. Please be careful here. The site isn't entirely secure. Hey, Arniel. Don't touch anything! Okay, okay. Jeez. Uh, yeah, he said I should help you out. What? Ah, yes. You. I remember you. You're going to help? That's fine, just... Just don't make a mess of my work. I've only looked through a portion of this section. You, uh... You can look around in the chambers just north of here. Try and be careful, all right? We don't want to damage anything. Uh, what do you need... Make here to do, exactly? Just round up the rest of the magical artifacts so that I can catalog them. All right, then. All right. Well, yeah, I'm using the, uh, I'm also taking anything. I'm using the, the quest markers, because I would literally never find those things. Literally never.
Ooh. Put some of those on. Oh, there's another one. Uh. Yeah, about this. What in the world was that racket? Is everything all right? I mean, I'm trapped. How in the world did that happen? Well, you know, I I started pulling things. You know, you, you said, "Oh, go go collect the stuff," or he said, "Oh, go collect the stuff." But then you're like, "Oh, you know, don't like disrupt anything." And you know, I don't know how we're supposed to do both. You really, like, that seems that seems like an impossible task. Really, perhaps the amulet is important somehow. Is there some way you can use it? Oh yeah, no, I'll just I'll just chuck it at the wall. Should I, is, that what, is that what I should do? I'm just gonna. Oh, you can't drop. I can't drop quest items apparently. Oh, yeah. You know, I'm sure if I just activate this. Oh, I have ward. Yeah, I didn't think that was gonna happen, or work, or whatever. Loudest thing in existence. I'm gonna have to mute that sound and blow people's ears out. I love these candles. I'm not sure what to expect here. Please be on your guard. I'm oh, sorry, did you see the freaking wall implode? Well, would you look at that? This appears to lead somewhere. Let's see where it goes. Oh yeah, let's see where it goes. Yeah, there's nothing bad that's going to be at the end of this. I mean, there isn't, because I already went there. But, like, there could have totally been. Why in the world would this be sealed off? What is this? Yeah, I look super unhappy about this. I'm just like, I don't care. I'm just like, whatever. It's not my problem. Oh god, I told you. Things. Hold, mage. Ah. Listen well. Know that you have set in motion a chain of events that cannot be stopped. Judgment has not been passed, as you had no way of knowing. Judgment will be passed on your actions to come, and how you deal with the dangers ahead of you. This warning is passed to you because the Sigic Order believes in you. You, Mage, and you alone have the potential to prevent disaster. Take great care and know that the Order is watching. Uh, okay. What the hell? I... I swear I felt something rather strange just then. What just happened? Nothing, don't worry about it. I guess some sort of ghost or apparition up here. Spot. I mean, I, I wish you'd lie to them. I mean, they don't even know that. I'm afraid I didn't see anything. Can you tell me more about what you saw? No. It said something about danger ahead and the Sigic Order. The Sigic Order? Yep. Are you quite sure about that? Yeah. That's very odd. I mean... And danger ahead? Why, that doesn't make any sense at all. The Sigics have no connection to these rooms. And no one's seen any of their order in a long time. Perhaps we should take a look inside these coffins. Now, please do be careful. Who knows what we're going to find? I mean, I feel like there could totally be danger ahead. That doesn't seem strange at all to me, but, uh, yeah. I mean, I think the fact that he froze time and appeared to me and talked to me was the more, was a stranger part than they talked about some weird order. They were a group of mages with a history that predates the Empire. Very powerful, very secretive. No one's seen them in well over a hundred years. They vanished, along with their sanctuary on the Isle of Arteum. 
I have no idea what connection they'd have to this place. Okay. I mean, why are they contacting me, hmm? I have no idea, but it's fascinating. Assuming it's true, of course. The Isle of Arteum disappeared over a hundred years ago, and no one has seen them since. And yet now, suddenly, they've chosen to contact you. Why, it's intriguing. If nothing else, I'd take it as a compliment. The Sidics have only ever dealt with those they feel worthy. All right. You have goods for sale, yes? So you wish to master the arcane arts? Uh, yeah, these aren't really... Well, I guess, actually... Yeah, let's do some candlelight. It's gonna help. Oh god. Uh fascinating. What is it? Oh my god, you look weird. What is that? Oh that's that's this oh, is simply fascinating. I was like, what happened? Yeah, no, it's just it's just oak skin. So weird. Oh my god, you look so weird. It's a lot of bones. Watch what you're doing. Oh, why don't you watch what you're doing? inspection. I'd like to stay a while and examine this. You, however, should press on. See if you can find whatever this vision of yours mentioned. But if it is truly dangerous, be careful. Go on ahead. I'll be sure and catch up with you before long. Taking all this, all of it. This is simply fascinating. Yeah, we heard you. Take a look. Can I sell anything? Nope. Okay. Mm -hmm. Nice. All right. Well, there we go. <laughs> I'm pretty defenseless, so I just got the two spells. Or really, just the one spell. Scavenging things. All kinds of things. You look peaceful. Oh, you look so peaceful. Alright. Yep. Okay. Plate. This plate will be my shield. God, that doesn't sound good. Oh god, no. Take the plate. I didn't want it anyway. There we go. Oh, it's a trap, huh? I don't think so. Ah! Oh, you guys are a lot stronger. No! <laughs> oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Ooh. Oh yeah, I have a... Uh... It's, it's like, oh god, Mercy Sounds of Skyrim or something like that. Uh, it replaces a lot of sounds, so 
They sound a lot more scary now. That's why they sound like demons or something. Oh. Oh, you want to do this, do you? I can play this game. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. There you go. He just crumples on the floor. Uh, so yeah, so if you hear weird sounds, that's probably what it is. They've been replaced. That's also why the magic sounds a little heavy-handed. Oh. Let's do the candle mod. I mean, that's, it's not a mod. Candle spell. What do we got here? like this. Also, these soul gems. Uh, if you haven't played Skyrim, you're probably like, I don't know what you're talking about. This is a, those look fine. Uh, or I don't know what those are. Probably is what you're saying. But, uh, or what a soul gem is. But if you have played Skyrim, then, uh, yeah. This is Morrowind soul gem. It's, I've just installed replacers. That replaces the, uh, the meshes and the textures to ones that are like Morrowind. It's not for the black soul gems or the uh, what was it like? You know the pieces, like the broken pieces, just like the lesser and petty and greater, and grand or whatever. So that's why those look different. Oh god! No, I'm plunging into eternal darkness. Why? Yeah, I know. It's because the the spell right now. I'm probably gonna get a torch for that one, for that issue. I mean, maybe. I don't know. I want to see some of those ones where, like, you auto-cast the mage. Or the candlelight spell. That would be pretty sweet. Because it gets kind of annoying to recast it every few seconds. But also, like, you don't want it on, like, infinitely. Yeah. That's one thing I miss already. That, oh god. The uh, the mod that allowed me to like turn on a, a light. Wildcat, you know, enabled as a mod. It's a little, magic's a little cheap, but, but I mean, if you get hit, you're, like, dead. So, I mean, it's not any cheaper, really, than arrows. Oh, God. Oh, wait, is it behind them? Yeah, it is. I remember the first time I played Skyrim, these things just like stumped me every time. I was like, what am I supposed to do? It was, it was ridiculous. It took me way too long. Like an embarrassing, like a totally embarrassingly long amount of time. It was, it wasn't that good. Wait, antique scroll? What? I've never seen that before. What mod is that from? Is that from a loot mod? Yeah, I have a loot mod. That like makes the loot more interesting, and uh, yeah, that's that's a lot more interesting. There we go. Thought I saw some stuff in there. Ah, you didn't hear a thing. Not a damn thing. Oh yeah, nobody saw me. Also, I've got a mod that makes it so that, like, the detection works a little differently. Oh god, so that sneak's not so, like, ridiculously easy. No, go away!
just like running away from them the whole time. Uh, yeah. So if you're like, wait, that's if you played Skyrim before and you're like, wait, that's weird. Why? Oh, I didn't even see them. Uh, you know, that's why. It's the mod. And in case I haven't already said this, this is gonna be a heavily modded playthrough. Like in, in case you you hadn't already gotten that, you know, that feeling. Yeah, that idea hadn't gone through to you. Then, uh, you know, fair warning. Oh, no. I wanted the uh, candlelight. There we go. Okay, I thought it was a dead end. I'm like, what? Oh, this looks like a trap. Uh, but it's not, I guess. Steel sword. Oh. Alright. Nope. Yeah, I'm also going to do that a lot. I'm going to be uh, accidentally equipping things when I mean to be dropping them. You keep trying to get me with these, these traps. It's not gonna happen. I'm vigilant. I could be a. I could be a vigilant. I'm so vigilant. Oh, -ho. nice. Okay. Oh God, it's one of these. No! Damn it. Uh, no. Yay! There we go. That wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be. I know this has been brought up like many times by many different people, but like. Seriously, who lights all the stuff? Like, who goes up there and lights that? It's just ridiculous. I mean, do the Draugr do that? I'm gonna say the Draugr do it. I thought it's high time I caught you. All right, cool. This is simply fascinating, isn't it? I swear to God, if you step on that, I will I'll murder you myself. I'm also looting. There are but dragons. We'll read that later. You deserve that. Okay. Oh god. Wait. Okay. We're good. We're good. Oh god, we're gonna die. Yeah. I do thought. Well, would you look at that? Oh no, it's pretty I crazy. Never, never should have come here. Never met. Wait, what? Come on now. Oh no! Stop! Oh god! No! 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 Oh yeah! No, that's gonna help. I'm taking this. Oh god! No! Stop! Oh no! 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 no. Oh, we're out of magic. Wow, okay. Just immediately died. Alright, and that was me dying, everyone. Well now, 
Would you look at that? Yeah, it's pretty sweet, I right? I never imagined we'd find something like this. It's amazing. Why is this buried so far within Sarthol? Right. I mean, totally. Okay, we're gonna kill him. Uh, he's protected, though. Oh no, you don't. The first time I played this, it was ridiculous. Like, I didn't figure that out for like so long that he was protected. So, uh, I just kept throwing throwing stuff at him. It was, it was crazy. He's a my magicka. Oh yeah, sure. It's not like you waited till I used up all my magic. Or anything like that. Oh god, no! Get away from me. Legend. <laughs> Be bound here, Yurik, murder, betrayer, condemned by your crimes against realm and lord. May your name and your deeds be forgotten forever, and the charm which you bear be sealed by our ward. Alright. Well, now he's unburied, so probably should have just killed him like we did. Whatever. That's a lot better. Alright, so hopefully we'll die next time Why, this is utterly unique utterly utterly tall dear oh uh yeah what the hell is that i have no idea this is amazing absolutely amazing absolutely amazing needs to be informed immediately he needs to see this for himself i don't dare leave this unattended can you return to the college and inform Sabo Saren of this discovery? Please, hurry. Uh, okay. But, uh, I'm keeping everything that I, uh, that I collected. Alright, I'm just, I'm just letting you know that right now.